Hey, what's going on guys? Akeem here, and I want to talk about one of my favorite diamonds, and that is Pink Diamond. Now, of course, we all know that apparently Pink Diamond was shattered, but we do not know exactly how it happened. The only thing we can do is speculate as to what happened to Pink Diamond. Of course, the rumor has been circulating that Rose Quartz was the one that actually shattered Pink Diamond. But what exactly did happen to Pink Diamond? I don't know if you guys are like me, but honestly, I wholeheartedly believe that Pink Diamond was never shattered. I've been going back and watching some of the older episodes of Steven Universe, uh, the ones where they mentioned Pink Diamond, and I've just come to the conclusion that it seems highly improbable that Pink Diamond was in fact shattered. If you look at the Steven Universe Memorial Day special Wanted, during the trial, it seemed as if Yellow Diamond had something to hide. A lot of people have speculated and gesticulated that perhaps Yellow Diamond was the one that actually shattered her. I mean, that seems highly improbable. The thing with Yellow Diamond is she is very brash and she is very quick to the point and quick to get angry. Blue Diamond actually sits back, absorbs what is happening around her, and she's extremely emotional. And I'm not gonna talk about that whole, the only thing strong enough to shatter a diamond is another diamond. I, 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 I'm not of that camp anymore. I used to believe that, but now I no longer believe it. I believe there is a bigger cover-up here, a larger cover-up. But this video I am making not necessarily to speculate about what happened to Pink Diamond. It's more as a homage to my favorite diamond, Pink Diamond. I don't want to talk about who may have actually shattered Pink Diamond because, as I stated earlier, I do not believe Pink Diamond is in fact shattered. I believe she's out there somewhere doing whatever a Pink Diamond does best. Nurture. Take care of those that she loves. From all the stories I've heard about Pink Diamond and from what I've garnered, it seems as though Pink Diamond's personality is very reminiscent of the personality of Rose Quartz. And it would make sense now, wouldn't it? Because Rose Quartz was in fact made by Pink Diamond. The quartz were made by Pink Diamond. So it makes sense for her to have the characteristics of her maker. But then again, I could be wrong. I could be a little bit off base when I uh, assume this particular notion. Because if you look at the story, Frankenstein, the monster in Frankenstein, didn't necessarily have any characteristics of his maker. Dr. Frankenstein. I mean, for crying out loud, he had the mind of a madman, a murderer. So yeah, putting that particular comparison aside, I really wholeheartedly believe that Rose Quartz is reminiscent of Pink Diamond. And of course there was in fact a rebellion. We all know that there was a rebellion, but we do not know what type of role Pink Diamond played in the rebellion. Or if my timeline is correct, maybe this was before the rebellion that she was shattered, which led to the rebellion, or she was shattered during the rebellion. I don't know timelines. But again, that is, again, assuming Pink Diamond is in fact shattered. Perhaps it is an entirely different cover up here. Maybe Pink Diamond was sent away through the cosmos by her sisters. Maybe Yellow Diamond was like, you know what, Pink Diamond, if you don't want to destroy the planet Earth, well then, you know, we have no use for you here uh, in this diamond triad. We're gonna have to get rid of it. Sorry, sis. But even that, I do not believe is something that actually happened. I think what happened, in fact, was Pink Diamond exiled herself. Pink Diamond was, you know what? I can't really take out these particular orders by my sisters destroying this planet and enslaving their people. So the best thing for me to do is to pretty much eliminate myself from this equation. So I'm not saying that Pink Diamond, what, committed suicide? No, she didn't shatter herself. What she decided to do was to go missing. But what does that mean when someone actually goes missing? Why would Rose Quartz be to blame for Pink Diamond being shattered if this was the case? If the case was that Pink Diamond decided to just exile herself and she's far off in the cosmos somewhere, then why would Rose Quartz be blamed for her shattering? And how did that even come into play? So this is why I think that there is a bigger cover up here. Perhaps Rose Quartz said to someone that I shattered Pink Diamond. Perhaps Rose Quartz said, I shattered Pink Diamond to someone and that word just spread like wildfire. When in fact, Rose Quartz didn't shatter 
anyone. She essentially was covering up for Pink Diamond being gone. These are just my thoughts. I am not necessarily certain what has happened. And honestly, who knows if we will ever find out the truth. Flashbacks can only go on for so long. I mean, there's only so much that can be told in flashback episodes. So will we ever find out the truth as to what happened to Pink Diamond? I have no idea. It is my hope. It is my wish that we will find out that Pink Diamond, where Pink Diamond is. I'm pretty sure a lot of you guys have your theories as to what happened to Pink Diamond and have your own beliefs as to what happened to Pink Diamond. So I would love to hear your thoughts on what you think actually happened to Pink Diamond. Are you of the mindset of she was shattered just because it was stated that she was shattered? Or are you like me and believe that she's not exactly gone? She's essentially out there somewhere traveling on her own, doing her own thing because she didn't have have the courage or the tenacity to destroy a planet that she so much loved herself. And since I believe we're never going to actually see the truth as to what happened to Pink Diamond or see a reveal of Pink Diamond in flashback episodes, I think what's going to happen is Pink Diamond will return in a future episode of Steven Universe. And it is then that we will find out the truth as to what happened to Pink Diamond. That is the only way we can find out the truth as to what happened to Pink Diamond. There's only two people that know exactly what happened to Pink Diamond, and that is Rose Quartz and Pink Diamond herself. So there's only two options we have. Either Rose Quartz tells us what happened to Pink Diamond, or Pink Diamond returns and tells us what happened to her. And of course, Rose Quartz can't tell us what happened to Pink Diamond because Rose Quartz is her son. So it is my firm belief that we are going to see the return of Pink Diamond soon. Hopefully soon. With what has transpired in the Wanted episodes, I firmly believe that we're getting a more serious tone of Steven Universe and we will actually get this type of reveal soon. But again, I would love to know your thoughts on what you think happened to Pink Diamond. Hopefully I was able to convince you of of the same belief as myself. And if I was, let me know in the comment section down below. Again, let me know your thoughts, your theories, your gesticulations, everything pertaining to Pink Diamond, because as I said earlier, she is one of my favorite diamonds. She is my diamond. She has always been my diamond. So I'd love to know your thoughts on her. And of course, I would love to know your general Steven Universe theories. So leave them in the comment section down below. And there's no theory too big, no theory too small, no theory too absurd. I love to read each and every one of your theories and I will. As always, thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a like and definitely share it with other Steven Universe people out there that love Steven Universe people because I'm a, I'm a Steven Universe people and you'll get a pearl point for that. Pearl point, again, thank you guys for watching and I look forward to seeing you in the next one, friends. Peace.